Do you use monofilament? Do you use fluorocarbon? Have you ever thought about trying braid? There's a few key components for you landing that big trout. There's your rod, your reel, your positive made attitude, and your fishing line. Many anglers have adopted braid as part of their trout setup. As a trout angler, your fishing line is super important to have a great experience in the water to catch all those trout and to land that big one, your PB. Today we're going to be talking about Phoenix Rod's new line of Iron Feather Elite Fiber Braid for Trout from three pound all the way to six pound. I've been using it for the past year or so, so I'm also gonna give you a tiny review and my thoughts behind the product. If you've been wanting to learn or know a little bit more about fishing braid on your reel for trout, this is the video for you. Let's get made. What's up anglers, Mike here, Trout Made Angler Company. Welcome to another video. Thank you for smashing on that play button and being with me today, wherever you are, whatever you're doing. So today, that's right, you guys have asked me, you've seen it in my videos, um, you see me fishing something pink. You know, it's not my rod or my reel either, you know. Maybe we should do a pink rod challenge, I don't know. But all jokes aside, anglers, and you've asked questions. You've asked, what are you fishing? What kind of braid is that? And I've been putting it in the link in my bio, and it's been a long time. I've been using um, the Iron Feather, Phoenix Iron Feather braid for over a year now. Um, I'm gonna be honest, it was a love-hate relationship. I'm gonna kind of get into that here in a minute. But as I used it this past year, I've grown very, very fond of it. I really wanna highlight this braid as an option for you out there on that water fishing for those trout. So let's get into it and um, kind of talk about the braid and my experience so far. So the first braid that came out for Phoenix for the Iron Feather Elite Fiber Braid is the Moss Green three pound and five pound, as well as the Pink three pound and five pound. Let's start with the Iron Feather three pound and Moss Green. Um, to be honest, I've probably, this was the first Phoenix Iron Feather braid I ever purchased. And this was well over a year ago, Angler. So based on my experience with the three pound moss green, three pound across the board in the moss green or the pink didn't really work out for me. Uh, moss green specifically, it was very, very hard to see because it is very thin diameter, very, very hard to see where my line was in the water. I like to see where my line is when you're jigging, you know, or, or use, spinning, using your rod action and actually putting action into your bait, you can see that line skip and jump when a trout hits it if you have some slack in it. So I like seeing my line. The three pound moss green from Phoenix wasn't allowing me to do that. So I thought I'd try the three pound pink. So I tried the three pound pink and I don't know if it was just me, my knots, not tying them right, I don't know but I had a lot of trouble and problems with the three pound breaking on me, um, snapping at my connection knot um, while I was tying it and while on some fish. So I bumped it up to five pound. I really, really wanted to fish braid. I wanted to increase my sensitivity and hookup ratio, bite to hookup ratio. I wanted to feel that bite a little bit more rather than you know what I used to use primarily, which was a two pound monofilament Iser line. That's all I used to throw anglers was straight two pound. But again, I wanted to try the braid. So now five pound, I've been using it, no issues, no problems. Again, I think it was me, I don't know. And since I've been using the five pound for the past, I don't know how long, this season for sure, well into last Sierra season, um, I've been liking it. I've loved it. I loved using the braid, the increased sensitivity, and definitely I've been hooking up a lot more because I'm able to feel that bite. 
It's very strong as well, stronger than the three pound, of course. It has two more pounds. I think it was just me. I've been loving it, anglers. I love the sensitivity. I love the casting, the smoothness, and the strength. I've been able to land some big fish on this braid. I'm really not sure what it was when it came to the three pound, whether it was just me, again, not tying my knots right, breaking off at my connection knot, or it was the braid that it was just too thin. You could try the three pound anglers, but again, in my experience, I did not really like the three pound. It was breaking on me. Again, maybe it was me, maybe it was my connection knots, I don't know, but that's where it was breaking. Um, again, um, while I was tying it and on some fish. So I don't really like the three pound. I think it was too thin in diameter, um, but it could have a place in your tackle box if you wanna try that out. Um, I'm really enjoying it and it's proven to be um, very strong, very sensitive and um, an essential need um, for me at this point. So recently, Phoenix has released four pound and six pound braid in lime green and fluorescent orange. I'm pretty excited about this because, you know, the four pound is like, you know, between the three and the five, obviously, but it's like that just right Maybe, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping it's just right. You know, like uh, the Three Little Bears Porridge, Little Red Riding Hood, you know. Uh, those are completely different nursery rhymes. But I'm stoked to put this on. Actually, we've already spooled up our reels. Um, I used both the four pound um, and six pound. So these are the four pounds right here. Uh, they both come in four and six pound test. We're going to take a look at the new braid by Phoenix Rod, their iron feather braid, four pound and six pound. And we're going to give you some specs and information anglers to see if you're going to go ahead, get you some of this braid and spool it up. That way you can get that sensitivity on your rod and your reel all combined with your line. It's going to make for an epic, epic bite for you on the water. So let's take a look at the new iron feather braid. The Iron Feather and Iron Feather HD Fiber Elite Braid from Phoenix is ultra strong yet feather soft, has zero stretch for that increased sensitivity, has superior knot strength, it's the smallest diameter of any braided line on the market, it's waterproof, it's UV resistant, super smooth means exceptional excellence, and you get more yards per spool. Each spool, no matter the test, the pound test is 175 yards of braid. The three pound test is 0.05 millimeters in diameter. The four pound test is 0.06 millimeters. Five pound test, 0.09. And the six pound test is also 0.09 millimeters. So there you have it, anglers. There's the info, some specs. In my opinion, my little review on the Phoenix Iron Feather um, Fiber Elite Braid. And that's the line of Phoenix Trout Braid the Iron Feather and Iron Feather HD. We took a look at the, the moss green that comes in three pound and five pound, as well as the pink three pound and five pound, the fluorescent orange four pound and six pound, and the fluorescent green four pound and six pound. Something else that I like to point out about the Phoenix braid anglers is that it's very manageable. And what I mean by manageable is sometimes line is very non-cooperative when you're tying knots. So when I'm tying the connection knot, the line is very, very manageable from the three pound all the way to the six pound. I played around with uh, all of them or used most of them. And I'm saying it's very, very manageable as well as on the water manageable. I have had very, very minimal wind knots. Usually when you're fishing braid, I got a lot, a lot of wind knots and I have yet to have a wind knot with the Phoenix Iron Feather braid. All right, anglers, there you have it the Phoenix Iron Feather and Iron Feather HD Fiber Elite Braid. We did the review. Um, I love it. I'm never going back to using straight monofilament ever again. I'm going to stick with the braid, the Phoenix Iron Feather Braid, Iron Feather HD, and I'm going to be using um, a fluorocarbon leader onto that. Currently, I use the five, four pound. I'm sticking with the braid, especially now that Phoenix has a couple of more different options, not just the cool colors, but as far as the pound test. Again, I'm really excited to use that four pound. I really think it's that sweet spot. And the six pound, I think is gonna be perfect for throwing spoons, mini cranks, and jerk baits.
So if you've been thinking about upgrading your trout fishing line anglers to some braid and ditching the monofilament or the fluorocarbon um, for your main line source on your spool, consider Phoenix Iron Feather and Iron Feather HD. Check out your local tackle shop, give them a call, or go to phoenixrods.com to get yours. There you have it, anglers. Simple, down, and dirty. Phoenix New Braid Iron Feather, Iron Feather HD from three pound to six pound test. So if you're looking to ditch the monofilament or that fluorocarbon, make Phoenix Rods Iron Feather Braid your choice. Got any more questions, let me know. Drop them in the comments below. Everybody hit that like button for me real quick if you wanna see more content like this. And as always, anglers, my name is Mike. This is Trout Made Angler Company. Thank you for watching this video. Go out, get yourself some Phoenix Braid, baby. I'm loving it. Again, any questions, drop them in the comments. I'm out. Catch y'all on the next one.